G O B. Welcome to another GOB course vlog video. I'm your host, Sun and Guns, here for part one of this 18 hole vlog, holes one through nine, here at Oak Shadows in Ohio, Midwest, here this week. Beautiful blue skies, green grass, can't complain about anything. Let's just go ahead and jump right into that first tee. Welcome back again. Hole one, par five. A little bit of a dog leg left to right and then back right to left over water. Nothing left to do but let the big dog eat right off the tee and I go right up the tree line up the left. Carrying distance and I meet that first goal. Fortunately blocked out by the trees so I just try to play one to the fairway and I accomplish that goal. Trying to have a wedge to short, and I blade one left to right, and it ends up to the bunker on the right. Splashy sand shot out of the bunker, out and one's the rule, good shot. Leaving me a long uphill par putt that swing swing, right to left and just short. But tap in bogeys in the amateur style are always a good thing. If you have a moment, go ahead and give the video a like, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Thank you for watching as always. Let's move on to the next hole. Jumping right into hole two, par four straight away as you can see, out of bounds right and left. Nothing left to do but tee it high, let it fly. I carry the ball with good distance right out into the short grass to start. Good play. Wedgie chip shot, trying to hit to the left side of the green and I meet that goal as it breaks back slight to the right. Long downhill birdie putt that picks up speed and zoom zoom right on by. Still going, still going. Leaving me a tough par putt on the way back. Let's see if I can convert. No, just a lip out, a tap in bogey. Good hole. Moving right into hole three, par four. Big dog leg right to left all the way up the hill. Just aim up the left side and I... Play my cutoff shot right to the center of the fairway. It's an excellent start. Leaving me a long uphill mid-range approach. Get slightly up and under it, but I definitely get onto the front of the green. Leaving me a big birdie putt up the hill, which Juju just runs out of steam next to the hole. But as you can see, just a tap in par. Always a great thing for an amateur. Great hole. Let's go. Moving right into hole four, par four. A little bit of a dog leg right to left, back up the hill. Tick it high, let it fly. Tick a tree just to the left, and it kicks back left to right. Ends up rolling right out into the rough, but in play. Can't complain about that. Fairway Wood just trying to carry distance up the hill. Gets slightly up and under it. But just right in front of the green, giving me a touchy chip. Bump and run we go, right onto the surface, get right below the hole. Leaving me a long par putt that swing swing. Just to the amateur side, the low side. But tap in bogeys in the amateur style are always a good thing. Moving right along. Jumping into hole five, par three, bunker left, water right. Just want to tee the shot to the middle. Play off my standard cut left to right and it lands on the right side of the green and kicks to the rough. Leaving me a bumpy chip. Get it back to the surface and just checks just enough. To not let it roll out, but long par putt to the high side. Got it to the hole. Again, just missed my line. Tap in bogey, no complaints about that. Always a good thing. On we go. Hole six, par five, straight away as you can see, and then back to the right slight. Let the big dog eat. I smash one well, right up the left side. Get a big kick to the right. Almost ends up on an upslope, giving me a launching pad with my three wood, and I strike it well. Try to end up short here, and I do, because there is water in play. Bumpy flop shot, lands probably about pin high and just rolls right on through. Leaving me a long birdie putt that swing swing right by the hole. Leaving me a tap in par and boom. 
What a great little pot. Great little haul. Let's go. Oh, seven par for a little bit of a dog leg left to right. Out of bounds all the way up the right side. Tease it high. Let's it fly with the driver again. Making good contact today right out into the short grass. Mid-iron approach gets ever so slightly up and under. Ends up just short into the rough. Leaving me a tough chip. Lands on the surface and swing, swing. There we go, right on by. Just barely stays on the green. Leaving me this uphill par putt that just runs out of juice right to left. But another little tap in bogey. Amateur style. Good hole. Hole eight, par three, straight away as you can see out of a chute, slightly downhill. Mid iron approach. Nice strike it well. Lands in the center of the green and rolls all the way left to right. Leaving me an uphill birdie putt. Put a good roll and it just doesn't break back in. But as in all things, it's a great thing to just have a little tap in par. Kaboom! Hole nine, par four. Great little finishing hole here on the front nine. Tease it high, lets it fly, and I strike it well one more time. Bounces left to right, right out into the short grass. Mid iron approach, gets slightly up and under it. Lands on the surface and rolls out slightly to the right, but green and regulation, uphill birdie putt. Just doesn't break back left to right. But I'm getting my putts to the hole, so a little tap in par. Back to back pars to finish. What a great hole. Great course. Great day. So, this has been part one of this juvie course vlog here at Oak Shadows in Ohio. Play some good golf, play some bad golf. But all in all, still have a great day. If you've enjoyed this content, give it a like. If you want to see more golf content, subscribe to the channel. And as always, thank you for watching. Everyone have a great day. Do you want to know?